Hello everyone, I'm teacher Jacqueline. For today's lesson, we're going to learn layers of the earth. Layers of the earth. 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 Earth is the third planet in the solar system from the sun and their home planet in which we live. Earth is the third planet in our solar system from the sun and their home planet in which we live. It is the only known planet in the solar system that contains free atmospheric oxygen, the largest amount of liquid water, and life. It is the only known planet in the solar system that contains free atmospheric oxygen and the largest amount of liquid, water, and life. Now let's continue with the four layers of the earth. Four layers of the earth. We have crust, crust, mantle, mantle, outer core, outer core, inner core, inner core. We have crust, mantle, outer core, inner core. Now let's continue with the first layer of the earth, which is crust. Crust. As the outermost shell of a terrestrial planet. As the outermost shell of a terrestrial planet. Earth's crust is a broken into many pieces called plates. Earth's crust is broken into many pieces called plates. The crust makes up 1% of the earth. The crust makes up 1% of the earth. Now let's continue with mantle. Mantle. The mantle is made of solid rock that is a very hard. The mantle is made of solid rock that is a very hard. It is separated into three layers, the lithosphere, the asthenosphere, and the lower mantle. It is separated into three layers, the lithosphere, the asthenosphere, and the lower mantle. The mantle is the largest layer of the earth. The mantle is the largest layer of the earth. Mantle has divided into three layers. We have lithosphere, asthenosphere, and lower mantle. The uppermost part of the mantle is rigid and together form the crust. The forms the lithosphere. The uppermost part of mantle is rigid and together of the crust forms the lithosphere. Next we have asthenosphere. The middle part of the upper mantle is composed of very hot, dense rock that flows like asphalt, and it is called asthenosphere. The middle part of the upper mantle is composed of very hot, dense rock that flows like asphalt, and it is called asthenosphere. Next, we have lower mantle. Lower mantle is hot and dense. Lower mantle is hot and dense. Now let's continue with the outer core. Outer core. The outer core is second to the last layer of the earth. The outer core is the second to the last layer of the earth. The outer core of the earth is like a ball of very hot metal. The outer core of the earth is like a ball of very hot metal. The outer core is a liquid. The outer core is a liquid. The outer core is made up of iron and is very dense. The outer core is made up of iron and is very dense. Now let's continue with the last layers of the earth we have inner core inner core the inner core 
if the earth has temperatures and pressure so great that the metal are squeezed together and are not able to move. If the earth has temperatures and pressure so great that the metal are squeezed together and are not able to move. The inner core is solid. The inner core is solid. Now let's review. What are the four layers of the earth? What are the four layers of the earth? The four layers of the earth are the crust, the mantle, the outer core, and the inner core. The mantle is the largest layer of the earth. True or false? The mantle is the largest layer of the earth. True or false? True. It is the outer core, a liquid or a solid? Is the outer core a liquid or a solid? Solid. Thank you everyone for watching. Hope you understand our lesson for today. And see you again to our next video. Bye!